going to be showing you how to make these really cool mason jar brush holders. They're really crafty ideas that you can use to hold your brushes, your pens, and they also make a great gift idea for the holidays. And actually what I love to do with these mason jars is to organize my brushes in them. So this one is specifically for eyes and this one specifically for face. So if you want to see how to make them, just stay tuned. For this DIY mason jar, you can use a dictionary, newspaper, sheet music, your favorite love poems, or a phone book. I think it would be really cute to put like a love poem or your favorite sonata on here for a gift. But basically what you're going to do is tear out the pages of a book and then pour some glue in a container and mix it with some water. It should be a about one part water to two parts glue or you can go to your local craft store and get some Mod Podge. So you're going to pin a thin layer of the glue mixture onto a mason jar and smooth on pieces of paper. Once your mason jar is covered in paper, finish with another coat of glue and smooth. Then let the glue dry immediately. For the vintage inspired mason jar, all you need to do is paint two thin coats of paint and we wanted to use white because it looks more vintagey, I guess. And then if you want a more opaque finish, you can do a few more coats after they have dried. And then once the paint has dried, we just tied the jar with a mason, or sorry, we tied the mason jar with a pretty ribbon. So for the next mason jar, you can just put some masking tape or any kind of tape around the jar, some paint, and then paint around um, and let the coat dry before painting another coat. And then you're going to just rip off the tape and you get a clean finish. And you can also paint different stripes and different colors with the tape. I love categorizing my brushes into different mason jars so I know where my eye brushes are, face brushes, and lip brushes are. So thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up this video if you want to see more DIYs or comment below on what DIYs you want to see for the holidays. And let me know if you do recreate this. Follow me on Instagram and tag me so I can see your recreation. So I will talk to you guys later. Bye!